I am going to attempt to vlog what I'm doing today. I'm going to go get hair extensions in downtown Shinjuku and I'm very excited. I hope they let me film inside the store. I'm not sure if they're going to let me but I'll bring the camera anyway just to test it out and I hope you like this vlog. So far my hair is at about this length. Last time we talked my hair was pinkish, purplish kind of color and I had to dye it black because the extensions are going to be black. I'm hoping to get it around waist length but we'll see how that actually works out. And yeah, I hope you enjoy this vlog. So, we're headed to the bus. I'm taking the bus there because I really don't feel like transferring on the train a bunch of times. Uh, let's see how vlogging in public goes. I try to record outside as much as I can, but today it's proven to be a horrible mistake because it's so cold um, and the wind is, is, is blowing very violently. But I can't wait until we get to the safety of the bus. So hopefully it'll come soon. We're waiting for it. It was supposed to come, well it is supposed to come in 10 minutes, but I, I try to come early to things. Um, also a mistake, I'm now realizing. Oh my gosh, two minutes till the bus is supposed to be here. Um, don't ask me why my background is my face, I, I can't really answer that question. Oh, it's here early. Thank goodness. So I am trying to find the shop and I can't find it so I give a call to the shop owner and I ask her where it is and she says she's going to send someone down to find, find me. Um, so I'm currently waiting at Moss Burger where she told me to wait and I'm in Kabukicho. So as you may notice my hair does not have extensions in it because I did not get them. Um, I went to the store store, went to the salon, and when I walked in, we sat down, we had a little consultation, she showed me the hair, and it was really nice, it was human hair, and she said the price is going to be 60,000 yen. Um, if you don't know what that is off the top of your head, it's, I bet it's about $600. And on the phone, I recalled her saying that it was 6,000 yen, which looking back now, doesn't make any sense as to why a full head of hair extensions would cost $60 but I thought it would, so I'm sitting there, and this is a cash-only place, so I have about $150 in my pocket, and I go, oh, I thought you said 6,000 yen, and the look this woman gave me, she was like, <laughs> so I had to get out of there really quickly, I didn't really know what to do, so I said, you know, can I schedule an appointment for some, some other time, and she said, yeah, sure, you can call any time, um, but I was more worried that I, I didn't have $600 to pay for hair extensions. So I scrambled around, I found the bus home, I went home and I opened up my little wallet where I keep all my my funds. And I currently have $690 to my dollars, to my name. So at this point in time, I cannot afford hair extensions. And I feel so terrible because I like assured her I was gonna call her back and I was gonna come back another day and I feel really bad, but I do not have enough money and I need to eat for the next two months. So that's my situation and that's why I do not have hair extensions. And to be honest, as soon as she said it was gonna cost $600, I was feeling pretty good about my hair. I was like, wow, I guess I don't really need them because my hair is pretty long. So that's why I don't have, um, an amazing ending to this video. Uh, I'm sorry, <laughs> but I'm going to probably lump this video in with another video that I take later, probably another little vlog thing, and then this will be just a sorry excuse for a transition into the next video. So, next video. Ne yeah, okay, bye. <laughs> Good morning, so I'm just gonna run you through. Uh, it's not working. <laughs> I'm gonna run you through. Good morning, okay, so uh, today I am going to school. That's about it, I'm just going to my classes. I decided I'd film it because why not? Um, we're starting off the day with breakfast. This is just a focus camera, kabocha soup. And it's because I've literally run out of everything else. So we're gonna put in some hot water and make this little soup.
What time is it? Tell me. It is 7.53 and my class is at 9. So I usually wake up around 7.15 to get all my stuff done. Like put my makeup on, do my hair if I need to do it, and make breakfast. So I'm going to head to class around 8.40. And hopefully I'll be able to record a little bit of what my class is like. Not actually my class, but maybe just what it sounds like or something like that. So I know. Your video is frozen. Is it? It is. It is. Why? I don't know. It's like 20 minutes before class, and no one is here. <laughs> Damn, I was really hoping to, to catch somebody and be like, hey, I'm filming you. Let's put my water bottle down here. So, oh dear, I am slanted. Very much so. Okay. This is, this is gonna end as soon as the teacher walks in because I don't really don't have the balls to show them. I have a camera in here. But for now, this is a typical classroom at Waseda. Um, for CJL people, CJL is a um, Japanese learning program they have here. Usually CJL classes are about maybe 30 people or less. They're really not very big. Um, so this class, Rebecca! Hi. Okay. No, don't worry about it. No, I was hoping to walk in and catch you here, but then no one was here, so I was like, okay. <laughs> That's Rebecca. Um, so yeah, CJL classes are usually pretty small in size, I would say. This class is like, what, 12 people? 13? Like, yeah, 12 regulars, so <laughs> maybe we have some people enrolled that don't come every time. Oh, what are you reading? Gintama. Oh, oh yeah, but... <laughs> yeah, yeah. Did you get it? Right? I don't think I saw it. <laughs> no, it's what I said. Oh, what did you say? I said, yeah, but. Oh. You cannot say that. <laughs> Is that from Bukka? Did you get it from Bukka? Mm -hmm. I just got a novel for Bungo Street Dogs. Eh. But I haven't read it, but it's a bit hard. My friend works yeah. in that book in a building. There's like a really building good. where Bukka Office. My friend works. There's like a little cafe yeah. on the side. My friend works there. Hey. Yeah, they sell like ice cream and toast and all that. Mm. Like book of cafe. Yeah, yeah. I oh. got like this. I bought like 40, 49 books. Oh, did you know? Oh, yeah. Books the, in? Yeah. Yeah, it's so cheap. Like, it's about 120 per book. That's pretty good. Yeah. Did you know that it's there's funny. Jump Festa last weekend? No, no Saturday I'm like not a huge fan. I just read, I just try to read the classic manga, you know? Yeah, I mean, Gintama is, is one of the Jump comics. So yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, my friend was crazy over that. It's really funny. I highly recommend it. Yeah, but <laughs> don't show the pants page. Oh my god! Of course, it's that one, right? Of course. Yeah, I have to mark this video now. It's like for work now.
timer to say where my next class is, so I have two hours and 23 minutes to do nothing. During this time, I eat. But I'm gonna take you to my fridge right now, which will show you why I'm not really in the best space for eating right now. As you can see, this is my fridge. I have about one, two, three, four items, not including my little face masks on this side. Basically, I have soba, mushrooms, bread, and soy milk to eat, and I'm not really in the mood to eat any of those. In my freezer, I have some spinach, broccoli, um, pumpkin in here, and I might make something with that. Maybe I'll just boil the pumpkin and call it a day. So I actually fell asleep, which is something I never, ever do um, when I have classes, but I actually knocked out, totally knocked out. So I'm still 10 minutes early for class, but I'm really surprised that I went to bed. I'm in class with my name tag and a familiar face. She's so tired. I'm tired too. She said she wants to skip. She's so bad. Wow, I'm not going to say Exactly. Because you look so cute in the coat. Wow. <laughs> you want to go eat some cake? You should skip your class. You've never skipped it? Then you should start now. Wow. Bye bye. See you. See you. No, not tomorrow. Jueves. Jueves? Okay. My friend. Oh. Hi. <laughs> what? This is the Amanda show. Oh, you want to see yourself? Look, you look, you look so cute. Oh, yeah. I do. <laughs> we are going to skip. I made this class and get some cake, yay! <laughs> this is your first time skipping your class. I haven't never skipped the class, so it's fine. Yeah, you've never skipped before, so you can totally do it. Yeah. Yeah, once though. Her, yeah, one, once is fine. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just gonna get some cake. You need it. Okay. Hi, uh, are you ready? Yeah, I just want a cake. Okay, hi. Uh, Marina, no, pizza, that's it. restaurant to go buy some french fries from the convenience store because Amanda is still hungry. We already left so yeah. Do you even know where the french fries are? Or if they sell them here? 
Oh, so potato chips. Yeah. You said, you said, oh, yeah, you said chips. Yeah. And I thought you meant British chips. No. Oh, I was, I was, I was wrong. Oh, they have new sweets now for winter. That's cool. Grab this. This. Let's see all the winter sweets. <gasps> what the? They have the pudding? What? Oh my god, my they pudding. Have... Cabo Chop pudding. They have something. This pudding is amazing. Oh no, it's not vegan though. I don't know if Japan considers mint chocolate to be like a winter thing, because it says for you ice. Um, but apparently mint chocolate chip is a winter exclusive flavor, which I find a little bit weird. This is a really like fake arm workout. My arm is hurting. <laughs> you want me to hold it? Yeah, I want I want them to see your face really closely. Okay. See, this is great. I love it. What? <laughs> I can I can move my arms around. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. Uh, if you're new here, subscribe. Did you? No, I'm not gonna say that. <laughs> it's so heavy. Oh my I, god. And that's what I just said. I just told you. I it thought it was, it's not plastic. I think. It's metal. No, yeah, it's metal and plastic. It only costs me. I feel like I'm gonna. You know the. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is yeah. You're working out. In those days. I actually have to hang up my other picture. I took this photo of Lily. I'm only having <laughs> <laughs> She's wearing all black. Wait, I'm actually gonna show this. So funny. So she's wearing all black. So it looks like she just has a head and no body. That's funny. apartment tour of my place updated now because I'm actually living here it's all messy so this is Amanda she comes here a lot she's basically part of my apartment this is a little mat where I do yoga and stuff but I'm not feeling lazy or tired this is a little heater in the back that doesn't work so I use it to hold on my stuff <laughs> like my hair stuff deodorant some perfume this is a little box in case of an emergency I put some books on there because I don't really use it. And that's a little heater that I used to use a lot, but I don't use anymore. Um, these are all my photos. I, t I take a lot. I'm pretty sure I've showed this before, but I take a lot of Polaroids of my life. And I've been gathering. The Japan ones start from around this line here. So all these are Japan, which now that I'm looking at it is a lot more than I thought. So, back to Amanda. So this is, that's my, that's my bag of laundry in the bottom. Let's not pay attention to that. This is my little shelf where I have all my clothes, my makeup, all that, Amanda stuff on the ground. This is my little table. I was boiling water this morning to make my soup. And this is the gum I just ate. I, so as for this huge window, um, obviously you notice this curtain does not fit my window. It's because this is a shower curtain. Now let me pull this aside. So they have this barrier here. This barrier was not here the past four months and people were doing construction and kind of just walking by my huge window and they could see me inside. So I was really uncomfortable with that. So I found this huge shower curtain because it's the only thing that I could find that could cover my window. So yeah, there's that. I have this little mat on the floor where I used to sit down when I blow dry my hair, but I don't really blow dry it anymore. This is my air conditioner. 
slash heater. This is my luggage. Oh dear. This is my luggage slash where I dump my coat when I come in slash where I dump my bags when I come in slash where I hold, hold my vacuum, I guess. Um, my little gas heater and my refrigerator that's not stocked with anything. This is my bed. This is my bed. I sleep on a futon um, that I kind of have gathered padding for as time goes on. The pink thing is a comforter, but I use it as a blanket. And this is my entranceway, which has a lot of shoes now, than, more than when I came here. This is my little kitchen. This is my entire kitchen. This is it. And this is a little caddy where I keep some soups, pasta, tea, cereal, and spices. And this is my bathroom over here. It's very small. And if we back up, you can see this is my entire apartment. It seems a little messy on camera, but it's really not that bad in real life. And then I have this sign in the entryway that my friend Lily made me, which is so sweet. I love it. Um, since my last video, I've actually changed the layout around, so I wanted to give an update on that.